In this quick little video, I'm going to show you how you can use a series of effects to turn this somewhat interesting shot into a work of art that you can frame and hang on a wall. Let's get started. I'm going to open up this image of a temple shot by one of my colleagues. As you can see, it's a pretty remarkable shot, but unfortunately, it's a bit underexposed. I think there's a couple of things that I can do to this image with PaintShop Pro X4 that will improve it greatly. I'm going to start by using one of the new features called Fill Light and Clarity. From the Adjust menu, I'll come down to Brightness and Contrast, and I'll select Fill Light Clarity. In this dialog box, I'm going to bring up my fill light to about 40, 40 or 50. And then I'm going to adjust the clarity, and this will sharpen the image somewhat. You'll notice that just these few little changes has really bumped up this image quite nicely, and we can now see detail in what was uh, originally a shadowed area. The next thing I want to do is add, adjust something called local tone mapping. Now, local tone mapping basically allows you to uh, enhance the depth of an image itself. So from the adjust menu as well, down to brightness and contrast, I have local tone mapping. Now, just to show you one other location where I can access this, under the enhanced photo, we have some very quick fixes uh, available to us right on the toolbar itself, so it's easier to, uh, to use these. I'm going to select local tone mapping, and then strength, I'll bring the strength up, I'll bring that up to about 40, and I'm going to increase my block size just slightly. And there we have it. I'm just going to click OK to this once it's finished processing. And now the final thing I want to do with this image is I want to add a frame around the perimeter of it. So from the image menu, I'll go down to picture frame. And we really have put quite a few different picture frames in the application. I'll simply click on this dialog box here to open that up. And I'll scroll down. I want to use a vignette style uh, frame. So I'm going to use edge smudge. And then simply click OK. That's all there is to it. I can now take this image to my local uh, output center and have this printed on canvas and hang it on the wall.